sure hope the sound is working. Give you guys an update. I'm passing through St. Louis, St. Louis, St. Louis, Missouri. Historic, <laughs> beautiful brick houses, bumpy roads, and the world famous arch, which is just off over there. The truck's going good, haven't had one little problem, nothing. Checking my fuel mileage, I got my own slips, I'm getting 9.8, 10.2, 44 East, Kansas City. That's where we're going. I was hoping to make Indianapolis tonight, but it's another 250 miles away. This thing's just going too slow. 45, 50 miles an hour, 80, 85, 90 kilometers an hour. It's a little underpowered or overloaded. You choose. It's running well though, it hasn't given me one little problem, nothing. The horn doesn't work, but it's just a loose wire, I jiggled it. Just didn't bother with it. I don't need to honk anybody, because I can't move fast enough that anybody should be in my way. If anything, I'm in their way. Oh, I like a road trip. This is definitely a road trip for the record books. Bang, 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 Kansas City, here we come. On to Kansas City, Kansas City, here we come. There's the speed limit that I like. 55 miles an hour. That's all this thing's got. Wow. Gateway Arch, exit 292. I like it when people watch the video and they say, hey, you're right nearby. And I'm going to post this video immediately. The, uh, the time is 7.15 p.m. And I'm going to put this video on YouTube right away. But I haven't got time to stop. I wanted to get to the Fort Bear convention, but there's also a 409 convention in Ohio, but I can't dance at all the parties. Bang, bang, oh yeah. Struggle, struggle, struggle up the hills. At least she's not overheating anymore. That gauge was all the way at the end and the little light here was flashing and the oil pressure light came on. But I think it's a bad sender. This thing seems to run too well. No clackety clackety. Another beautiful day. Enjoy each day and squeeze the most out of each day that you can. Life is like an orange. You gotta squeeze as much out of it as you can. I sure do. I got a couple friends that are saying, you're overdoing it. I know. But, on the other hand, I could be homeless like those people living in the shadow of a five-story, six-story brick building. I'm not homeless. Well, actually I am. I have a house, but I don't have a home, but I'm working on it. 